when jazz artist Esperanza Spaulding beat Justin Bieber for Best New Artist at the 2011 Grammy Awards, his fans lashed back by defacing Spaulding's Wikipedia page. Well then, it's a good thing metal band Deftones don't hate Justin Bieber. And frankly, they are sick of the media asking them if they do. I've never heard you guys like bash another band or another form of music. Because it's not about that. It's really just about... It's for, me, for me, I can say that it's about you know why people are doing it, the energy exactly. behind it. There's and nothing, you can't, you can't what? make fun of or hate on somebody because yeah. they're doing something they love. Exactly. Or like we've been doing these interviews in the last few days and everybody keeps asking us about Justin Bieber and this and that, yeah. whatever, and it's like, why would, I, why would I have anything negative to say about Justin Bieber? He's a kid, for one. And he's doing what he's doing. That's great, man. You know what I mean? Like, that's awesome. You know what I mean? Whether whether you you really listen, like his music or not, it, it's great what he's doing. You know what I mean? And uh, and a lot of people love it. So why why talk about it? That is, you know he is going to hate, yeah. 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 It's like <laughs> I don't even understand. You know what there is to hate. You know, yeah. I mean? it's like people. Put, it takes a lot of work to, to to do anything on any level. You know, in whatever your pursuits are. And and when you see someone doing that, to me, it's just like, wow, that's really awesome that like, these people are doing that. And it doesn't matter to me what sound they're making. Plus, he seems like a really nice kid. You know? Yeah. Have you ever heard an interview with him? Like, I watched him. Like, he he actually like seems like a really good kid, yeah. a good-hearted kid who's like works hard. He's just working, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You know what it's I mean? Just a job, he, like, yeah. he, he likes music too. It might yeah. be you know pop music, whatever, or, or you know it might not be the deepest music ever, but yeah, it's, it's nothing wrong with that. Man. We were all kids once. You know what I mean? Like Justin Bieber, Deftones aren't strangers to the Grammys, having won the award for Best Metal Performance at the 2001 ceremony. Did you think the band has made it? Or just life went on? No, I mean, I, um, it, it was a good feeling to, to feel like, you know, that we were recognized by, you know, by the Academy or whatever. You know, they're, they're, they're pretty much, you know, it's a big thing, I guess, you know, in the world, I guess, not just in the States, but, uh, you know, to win a Grammy. So it was pretty cool, but... Um, it wasn't like really life changing in a way, you know. I don't think. It, I mean, uh, it wasn't like you know that happened. Then all of a sudden it was like, wow, we made it. You know, yeah. we're we're a legitimate band. I always felt like we were, you know, that, that we were doing good things. And we've always had um, our gradual build on our whole career. It was never like one day we were nobody. Then all of a sudden we were, you know, famous one day. You know, we you know, we worked really hard and we took little baby steps the whole way to get where we are. And, and um, even though we're not the biggest band in the world, I feel really accomplished that you know that. It's been, you know, um, 20 years or so since we started, and, uh, and we're still able to play and still able to go up to places new like Singapore and play shows for people that that care to see us. You know, it's a good feeling. I think that's that means more to me than any kind of award or anything. You know, with a career that began with the 1995 album Adrenaline, it's hard to think of the Deftones as an old band, especially when they keep acquiring more fans with each album. So, what do you think um, this band actually gets new fans? every album you know um what i think about it actually is also speaks to the to to the internet and and mm -hmm. technology today and that um i think now more than ever that human quality and that spirit you know like people whether they're conscious of it or not you know that that becomes the the factor the indicator that's something that really sparks within somebody because it's very easy to produce music it's mm -hmm. very your computer comes with this necessary software to make albums you know for free and and i think that the that the real, you know, qualitative factor is is your heart and your spirit and the and, and the soul that you put into what you're doing. It's really about the sincerity and the energy that's put into it. I think that that translates now, and I think that people pick up on that. Thanks.